Hey, what up, Z-Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, we'll cover the Atomic Shop, see what we got for today, and afterwards, we're going to take a look at the daily challenges, see what we got to do in order to make some score. So, let's start wasting time, jump right into it. Alright, so let's navigate to the Atomic Shop and see what we got today. Today, actually, we got some good stuff. So, if we go all the way down... Oh, by the way, by the way, today is Monday, so many deals are ending. So, you might want to scroll down through uh, the shop and see. Because, like, for instance, this section is leaving today. And uh, you might want to grab something before it leaves. So, and this section as well looks like to be so. But we're taking a look at this section right here. We've got the Blood Raider skin. There we go. It's a really good skin, I gotta tell you. I used it myself and I used it for my combos and I love it. It's only for the Excavator Power Armor. So it goes with a 50% discount and you can acquire it for 50 atoms. Then we got the Communist uh, Collectron, which I forgot to do a review for and I Actually, I never even used this guy. <laughs> oh, man. I, I can't believe I actually bought it as well. I thought I didn't buy it. Huh. Huh. Well, it's just another Assaultron. <laughs> Assaultron uh, that tries to collect food, water, supplies, weapons, grenades... Uh, party. Oh, by the way, a lot of flyers. Oh, yeah, actually, I did use them. I remember now. That's just, that's just crazy. I think there was a bug with this uh, assault run. He used to collect a whole bunch of those uh, propaganda flyers. Just ridiculous amounts. So, uh, those who have actually used this Collectron a lot, can you drop your feedback on this uh, Collectron? And let us all know whether it's worth it or not of getting I know a lot of Z Clan members uh, used this guy and said some good feedback. I just can't remember right now uh, what exactly it was. <clears throat> All right, so that is that for the Atomic Shop. Let's go for the daily challenges. See what we got to do. So, uh, buy an item or sell an item to another player. Okay, that's super easy. Uh, you go to any uh, player's camp and if he has ammo, just buy one bullet, one bullet, one bullet. So you gotta do the transaction three times and it will work. Uh, claim a workshop, super easy. Any workshops you would like to do, you claim it and you get it. Uh, then uh, complete an event. Uh, you can actually clap this with this one right here. Uh, basically what you do is <clears throat> you claim the workshop, wait for the defend workshop to trigger, defend it and you get to complete this one as well. Uh, eat a cooked meal. <laughs> I already got uh, two out of five because I just ate right here. So as you can see, I have a whole bunch of food. So bam, you gotta eat actually what you've cooked, not what you found. And bam. So as you can see, this one is extremely easy. So we got that done. Uh, then if you do five challenges from these dailies, uh, you will get this as an additional reward. Then kill super mutants. Uh, for low level areas, I would recommend coming uh, to this location right here, Somerville. They got uh, super mutants, you can kill them there. Uh, if my memory doesn't fail me, super mutants also protect the Wade Airport. Sometimes you can find super mutants at the uh, Charleston area. Uh, I think that is it. Uh, although, I'm gonna go try my luck over here with you so I can double check that that is actually true for veteran players. West Deck obviously is the number one source of killing mutants. Then you got Huntersville for killing mutants is 100% locations. General Steakhouse as well. Well, basically, if you're a veteran and you've been playing this game for a lot, you definitely know where to find mutants, man, because they're the best guys to kill for the XP. <laughs> All right, level up one time and you get 500 score. Uh, kill a player, get 250 score. Rank up a perk card and you get uh, 250 score. So rank up perk card I believe is if you do something like this. You go to your perk cards and by the way I'm pretty sure all of you have unlocked a lot of different rank up. 
There we go. Assemble the army. I got a new follower. <laughs> Welcome to Z Clan. Thanks for the follow on Twitch. Why these notifications are working when I'm recording? <laughs> ah, but yeah, it's actually good. Z Clan. There we go. We got it. <laughs> okay, challenges. So pretty much. They are all pretty simple. If you're a veteran and you know how to do them, this is more than good enough for you. And you may want to stop watching the video here. And uh, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Uh, if any tips and tricks that you think might be useful. For those who do not know how to do it, I'm going to do these with you right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to start off with buy sell things from another player. And we're just going to go to this location right here. Because we can see that player is selling some ammo and uh, we'll just buy one bullet of each and get that completed. Alright, so here we are. By the way, we see a Z-Clan member over there. Hey Musket, what's up? How you doing, brother? Hello. Oh, by the way, I need to change that backpack. That backpack skin doesn't look good. Uh, with I've been doing a review, so... Oh well. Uh, how much you want to bet he's buying my ammo? <laughs> Alright, so what we got here? Ah, oh, no, we got the ammo here. Actually, let's buy something useful like 50 cal rounds. Boom. Well, that's one. Boom. That's two. Boom. That's three. Done! Now we're gonna go and capture ourselves a workshop and trigger an event. Alright, so you capture the workshop, right? You can capture a whole bunch of different workshops, it doesn't matter what you capture. For low level areas, obviously I would recommend these ones right here, and look, there's someone already uh, doing an event right there, so I'm just gonna quickly jump on that event right there, uh, so I don't have to wait until mine triggers, and I'll uh, complete the complete the event. Right now we just completed the capture the workshop, so let's go and uh, help those guys with defense and get a reward for doing an event. Hey, can you believe it? I just jumped and they completed right on the second. <laughs> oh wow, rank 76, what's up? Alright, well, uh, that's cool. By the time I load it in, bam, and I complete the event. Cool, 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 I like that. Uh, now we're going to Summersville to kill some super mutants. And I'm showing that location uh, just in case to help the lower level players. If I weren't to be doing a video right now, I would go straight up to West Egg. <laughs> Alright, so here we are, and now we should be seeing some super mutants. Uh, that's where you will end up if you spawn into this location. And there should be some super mutants right here. Plus, if my memory isn't failing, there should be a wedding ring that you can pick up here. If you didn't know that wedding rings exist, and, I mean, not a win there is a ring, and there's a wedding ring. No! There's no super mutants. Uh, I haven't been here since the wasteland update. Cockroach game. What are you doing here, blood eagles? Damn it. Oh man. I hate this game. Why? There used to be super mutants here. By the way, the winding ring is right under this hat. If you pick it up. Ta da. Oh, that's an old ring. The wedding ring is. You can find it if you go to. To. If you fast travel to Nuka Cola Plant, but on the traveling point you will end up here. In this area you have a house, you find a cockroach with a hat on, you uh, look at the cockroach and you find uh, the hat, I mean the wedding ring. Uh, but yeah, I also made a video on that, so if you want to check it out uh, to find where you can do that. Man, also super mutants were over there as well. Oh well, I guess the only location now for the low levels is uh, Grafton Dam, that's whatever that's coming right into my head right now. There's definitely mutants, always super mutants over there. Unfortunately, they not know that this place doesn't have mutants no more. Damn it, I haven't been there for a long time. <laughs> At least now I can tell you, ain't no super mutants there, man. Don't go there. But of course, over here you definitely have super mutants because I come here pretty much on a daily basis, especially when the manhunt event starts. I just wanted to say that's the best event also because it gives a good amount of caps, it spawns more super mutants, and it's actually a really cool event to get a lot of XP as well, especially if your uh, party is set to uh, the event farming. So that's a hundred percent more, but on its own, 
Oh man, you can walk in here. Oh, by the way, if you will not be able to open the door and you don't have hacking skills, then you might want to run this way. Then you gotta jump down to this thing right here. And then somewhere in this building you'll have to find the key and you will never need to hack things again. But this is the another entrance where you don't need anything in order to get inside. So now that we have that covered, just in case for new players who don't know how, how to get inside. Now you guys know how to get inside. And then you just completely go in here and start shooting all the super mutants. You shoot this guy, you complete the event. I could have done another event right here just now, but bam, we got it done. Mission complete, and all we got left is kill a player nuclear winter. Oh wait, we're not done. We need to find one more super mutant. I'm gonna take your score, man. Uh. What the hell did I... Ah, it's probably the repeatable, that's what I got. 10k repeatable challenge so what we have left is level up and kill a player in nuclear winter that's it all right well the remaining of the challenges I'm gonna do by myself uh, as they just need to require for me to level up so you all know the drill don't forget to hit that like if this video helped you out a little bit and comment down below please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube nobody see them I see them I read them and I delete them have that in mind Ooh, who is that <laughs> hello mm. Z Clan, no Z Clan, Z Clan. <laughs> Haven't seen him before. Hello. So yeah, as I was saying, don't forget to leave the comments. Don't swear if you want your comments to be read, and uh, don't forget to hit that like. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Sol from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. I hope you enjoyed the show. And uh, join our Discord if you want to have fun, team up with other guys, trade, or maybe receive some help. Uh, we have an active Discord, over 500 members, and about average active uh, 100. So definitely, you might gonna love that Discord right there. Uh, the other thing is, you see, you, you see, definitely that night. <laughs> All right, on Discord, rules apply as well. Don't follow the rules, get banned. So read the rules. In short, family friendly. That's it. But read the rules. No inappropriate usernames. You will get banned. No spam. You will get banned. And a whole bunch of other stuff. So I'm trying to keep our community uh, clean. No toxicity and all of that stuff. We just have a, our own kind of family, right? Where we all have fun. That's it. As simple as that. So break the rules, get banned. <laughs> and, uh,. If you agree with the rules, go to the Get Started section chat, uh, select the Z sign that you agree with the rules, get access to the general chat, select the platform you play on, so it'll be easier for you to team up with other Z Clan members or me, myself. Uh, and uh, select the games that you play uh, to get access to the chats of those specific games. So if you play Fallout 76, click Fallout 76, get access to all Fallout 76 chats. Simple as that. Alright, Z Clan and everybody else, once again, thanks all for watching. You all have a good morning, day, and night, whatever you guys lock like it at, and I'll see you on the next video. Right. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the clan, we have a gamer's soul. By the mind of the sword, we put the pen to the test. We are the clan, we are the gamer's best.